appreciate him for what the Lord is doing right now in your life, for what the Lord is doing right now in your home, in your family. Somebody appreciate the King, appreciate the Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank Holy Spirit of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank Holy Spirit of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. We thank you, Lord. We worship you. We honor you. You are God Almighty. There is no one like you. Somebody lift a voice and begin to appreciate it. You are God Almighty. There is no one beside you. You are God Almighty. There is no one like you, oh God. Somebody let's lift our voice and begin to appreciate you, oh God. He is the King. He is the Lord. The Lord Almighty. Jehovah and Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end of all things, let's appreciate Jehovah God. Father, we thank you. Father, we honor you. Jehovah God, we glorify you. Thank you, El Shaddai, for what you are doing, O oh God, for what you will do. Let's lift our voice and begin to appreciate it. Somebody lift your voice and begin to honor him. Let's lift our voice and begin to bless the Lord. Bless him from the bottom of our heart. Bless him with everything that's in us. Let's lift our voice and appreciate you, O oh God. Lord Almighty, we return all the glory back to you. We return all the glory back to your name. We return all the glory back to you, O God. Somebody thank him, thank him, appreciate you, O oh God. Everlasting Father, we return all the glory back to you. The O oh God, the O oh Nisi, we return all the praise back to you. We lift our voice in honor to your name, O oh God. We lift our voice in praise to you this morning. For this privilege that you have given to us, for this privilege that you have released to us to run to you, for this privilege to come to you, God, somebody begin to appreciate him and thank him for this great privilege that we receive to come before the Lord. Let's begin to thank him, let's begin to honor him. The over God, we thank you. The oh God, we worship you. We worship you for your grace. We worship you for your love. We worship you for your kindness. We worship you for your goodness. We worship you for your love, oh God, for what you have been and for what you do in our life, in our own everlasting Father. We turn all the glory back to you. Jehovah God, we return all the praise back to you. We return all the honor back to your name. Somebody thank him. Appreciate him. Appreciate the Lord. Appreciate Jehovah God. Appreciate the King. Say to him, Lord, we thank you. Lord, we honor you. Lord, we praise you. Lift your voice and bless the Lord. Lift your voice, bless the Lord. Lift your voice, worship the Lord. Lift your voice, praise Him for what He has done for us, for what He will do. Give that praise to him. Give that honor to him. Give that glory to him. Give that praise to the Lord. For great is the mighty thing. Great is the faithfulness of God. Great is the faithfulness of God. Great is the faithfulness of God. Towards us, towards our life, towards our children. Somebody thank him. For what he has done and for what he will. 
I appreciate the King this morning. I appreciate the Lord this morning. Say thank you to Him for waking you up. Thank you to Him for being there for you. Thank you to God for being there in your life. Thank you, Jesus. Let's begin to thank Him. Let's begin to appreciate Him. Let's give that honor to Him. That praise to the King. That praise to the Jehovah God. Let's celebrate Jesus. Let's celebrate Jesus. Let's celebrate Jesus. Let's honor Jesus. Let's give that praise to Him. Let's give that honor to Him. Let's give that praise to the Lord. My Lord and my Father, we thank you, Lord. My Lord and my King, we worship you, God. We worship you for your grace. In Kadara Soto Telia, Mazukatari Maoso Toria Maazikaya. Lift your voice and bless him. Lift your voice and glorify him. Bless the name of our God. Bless the name of our King. I appreciate him for what the Lord is doing right now. Thank him with all your heart. Let's thank him with everything that's in you. Let's appreciate him with everything that's in you. Let's honor him with everything that's in you. Let's thank him with everything that's in you. Let's give you praise with everything that's in you. Let's honor the Lord with everything that's in you. Let's glorify the Lord with everything that's in you. Let's worship Him. Jesus, we thank you. Rock of ages, we honor you. Rock of ages, we worship you. Rock of ages, we give you praise. Rock of ages, we say thank you to you. Our healer, we thank you, Lord. Our Savior, we thank you, Lord, this morning. He told us, enter his gate with thanksgiving, his court with praise. That is the principle. We enter his gate with thanksgiving, his court with praise. Let's enter the gate of him with thanksgiving in our heart, his court with praise. Let's know that he is God. Let's know that he is King. Let's know that it's Jehovah God. What a mighty God. Be shall. What a mighty God. Be
Let's lift our voice and appreciate Him. Appreciate the Lord. Lift our voice is good to us every day for waking you up this morning, for being there for you. Let's lift our voice and appreciate Him. Lord, we thank you. Everlasting Father, we thank you, Lord, faithful and righteous God. We honor you for grace. We honor you for your love. Let's appreciate Him as we come to Him. Let's appreciate Him as we lift our voice in praise. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Yes, yes, is the Lord Almighty. Father, we thank you, Lord. There's no one like Him. There's no one beside our God. There's no one beside the King. There's no one beside the righteous one. There's no one beside the faithful one. Somebody appreciate the Lord and give that honor to Him. Jesus. Jesus is a reason that we are standing today. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we honor you. Glory, glory. Hallelujah. Glory, glory. You are the extra die. There is no one beside you. There is no one like you. You are the Lord Almighty. You are the King. You are my Savior. Thank Jesus for what He's doing. Thank Jesus for what you will do in your life this morning. Lift a voice in praise to the King. In honor to our God. In praise to our Savior. Thank Him, Jesus, we thank you. Jesus, we love you. Jesus, we glorify you. Blessed be the name, O God. Blessed be the name, El Shaddai. Thank you, God. Thank Holy Spirit of God. Thank you, Jehovah God. 
We thank you, Lord. 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 We worship you, God. We bless you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, everlasting Father. Thank you, Lord, for what you are doing. Jehovah God, we thank you. We honor you. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Let us begin as the Lord, Daddy. I look unto you. Father, I look unto you. Let all my sin be forgiven, O God. Somebody begin to lift a voice and begin to say, Lord, I look unto you. Let all my sin be washed away. Let's begin to pray. Let's begin to open your heart to pray. My Lord, Almighty, Almighty God, lift your voice to end. Jehovah God to you. In the name of Jesus. Say, Lord, let all my sin be washed away. Open your heart to God. Lift your voice to end. That Jehovah God, I look unto you. In the name of Jesus. Somebody open your eyes. Tell the Lord that you look unto him. You look unto God for deliverance this morning. Jehovah God, I look unto you. In the name of Jesus. Somebody open your heart to God. Begin to ask the Lord. Tell him that you look unto him. Jehovah God, I look unto you. In the name of Jesus. Somebody lift your voice and begin to talk to God. The Lord Almighty, I look unto you. In the name of Jesus. Mazukatari Mazutelia. Lift your voice to him. That you look unto him. In the name of Jesus to your healing. Say, Lord, I look unto you. For my deliverance, O God. Somebody open your heart to God. Let's begin to pray. The Lord God of heaven. I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Lift your voice to him. Let's begin to cry before the Lord and talk to God. God, I look unto you. I look unto you for my deliverance, O God. Father, I look to you for healing. Somebody pray. Tell the Lord that you look unto him in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. Pray and ask the Lord. My Father, I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Repasuto kona anda isate bakantoria anzikada. Lift a voice to him in the name of Jesus. Pray and talk to God. Tell the Lord that you look unto him, my Lord and my Father. I look unto you, Jehovah God. I look unto you for my deliverance, O God. I look unto you for my healing, O God. I look unto you. For my turn around, O oh God, somebody begin to pray in the name of Jesus that you look unto God. Lord, I look unto you. Somebody begin to tell the Lord that you look unto Jehovah God for your deliverance this morning, for your healing this morning, for your open heaven this morning. Pray and talk to God. My Father, I look unto you. O oh God, I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Let's begin to pray. Let's begin to ask the Lord. My Father, I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Ask the Lord that you look unto him in the name of Jesus. Jehovah God, I look unto you. Lord, am I king? I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Let's pray. Let's ask the Lord that you look unto Jehovah God. My Lord, am I king? I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Somebody open your heart to God, the Lord God of heaven. I look unto you right now in the name of Jesus. Let's pray, let's ask the Lord. My Father, I look unto you. Jehovah God, I look unto you. My Lord and my King, in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to him. My Lord and my God, tell the Lord that you look unto Jehovah God. For your deliverance right now. For your healing right now. Tell the Lord you look unto him. Father I look unto you. For your grace in my life. I look unto you. 
for your mercy in my life. So we pray that you look unto God in the name of Jesus. I look unto you for a turnaround. I look unto you for a turnaround. Somebody open your heart to God. My Lord and my King, I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to Him. Lift your voice to Jesus that you look unto God. My Lord and my King, I look unto you for my deliverance in the name of Jesus. Jehovah God, I look unto you for my open heaven. Somebody pray. Talk to the Lord. Talk to the King. That you look unto God in the name of Jesus. Jehovah God, I look unto you. Mazuka talaba zika tayaba. Le prendo zika teria. Bado zike telem brando zikiaba. Open your heart to God. That you look unto God for your deliverance this hour. For your healing this hour. For your open heaven this hour. Lift your voice to him. Father, I look unto you. Break every satanic yoke in my life. Father, I look unto you. In the name of Jesus to deliver my life. Open your heart and pray. Pray and talk to God. Say, Daddy, I look unto you this morning. For my help, somebody pray. Let's pray and talk to God. Let's pray and talk to Him. Tell the Lord that you look unto Him. You look unto God in the name of Jesus. For your deliverance this morning. I look unto God. Open your heart to God. Lift your voice to Him. Tell the Lord that you look unto Him. Lord, I look unto you in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray. Pray and ask the Lord that you look unto the Lord for your healing. I don't know why you are here this morning, but let him know that you are looking on him for your deliverance. You are looking unto him in the name of Jesus. You are looking unto him for his strength. You are looking unto him for his power. Father, I look unto you for your strength today in my life. For my victory, somebody pray in the name of Jesus. Somebody open your heart to God. That you are looking unto God. Le prendo sika telebo. Madako rasi kata. Bunturema onse telebo. In the name of Jesus. Mazika to yama suto lima an. Pray, 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 pray. Repa zuto konde andaye. Open your heart to God. Let's lift our voice to Jesus. That we are looking unto God for our, our, our breakthrough. Tell the Lord you are looking unto Him for your breakthrough this hour, for the healing of your life, for the deliverance of your soul, for redeeming me in the name of Jesus. Father, I'm looking unto you. Somebody tell the Lord. Tell Him why you are here. Tell Him that why you are here. In the name of Jesus. We are looking unto Him for His strength. Father, I'm looking unto you for my strength today. I'm looking unto you in the name of Jesus for my deliverance today. I'm looking unto you to break the yoke of any of them. I'm looking unto you to turn things around. I'm looking unto you in the name of Jesus to save me. Open your heart to God. Lift up all Jesus that you are looking unto him. You are looking unto him. Somebody pray to help you this hour to set you free. In Jesus' name, we pray now. Tell the Lord, you are looking unto Him for certain things. Now, tell everything, every power, every situation of my life that will not allow me to see it, remove it in my life. Whatever thing that will allow me to see what I'm looking for before you, Holy Spirit of God, remove it this hour. Whatever thing that see my life, that is holding me to see what I'm looking for. I, I, I know you are not just coming out for, no, even though you just believe God today, that, oh, I just, I think I can get a job, I can, God can still do it. Many of you think you are, you are trusting God for years, so years that be silent things, you have been believing God, you have been waiting for those things to come to pass, and you are waiting for God's ways to happen. There are many things that, oh, you think you can do it, but God waiting on the Lord means you are waiting for God's way, God's way of doing it. And you know that it's God's way of doing it will be the best for your life. I want you to lift your voice and tell the Lord, 
everything that's hindrances, whatever that's obstacle that's in my life, that is holding it from me, my father remove it right now. I want to begin to lift your voice. Maziki telia nanama oso tolia daba. Open your heart and pray. Pray, 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 pray. In the name of Jesus, open your heart to God Almighty. Whatever has hindrances that is delaying this breakthrough from me, whatever that is hindrances that is delaying this joy from me, every stumbling block in the name of Jesus. Open your heart and pray. Le prendo sicata. Le prendo sicate. Open your heart and pray. Pray and talk to God. Whatever has hindrances, whatever has obstacle that's in my way, that is de tareba su toreba, matoria makataya, la prendo su toyao. Whatever has hindrances, whatever has obstacle, in the name of Jesus. Every power, ma sotole ma rasate, ma derabate kereba, whatever in a raba sun to ya own, that is delaying the glory, as the Lord, whatever thing that stands in the way, in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray, whatever that stands in the way, whatever as in a seed that seem alive, that is holding me, in the that that was sotole own. In the name of Jesus, Mazuto Kora Basi Ketelebon, whatever thing that is delaying me, in the name of Jesus, Mata Teria and also Toyaba, Maneta Prando Sikion, open your heart to God, whatever as entrances, whatever as obstacle, holding down the breakthrough, whatever thing that's in my life that don't want me to receive this, open your heart to Him. Father, begin to remove right now. Somebody pray. Let God begin to remove every hand of failure, every hand of enemy. Masoto Rama Sikata. Pray and talk to God. What everything that is holding me not to receive. Every blockage. Open your heart to God. Every blockage. In the name of Jesus. Every obstacle. Every power. In the name of Jesus, deny me of this blessing, robbing me of this glory. In the name of Jesus, as I come to you, God, somebody begin to pray as the Lord Mazuko Toria Maka, Le Prende Siketeon, Repatoria Makata, Matoto Le Pratata. In the name of Jesus, somebody pray to God. I don't know what is your way, but you can tell the Lord. The God of heaven to remove it. I don't know what the enemy is doing. But you can tell the Lord to remove it. Every obstacle. Every blockage. Every hindrance That stands in the way. Of my moving forward. Of my going higher. Jehovah God. In your power O oh God. Remove now. In your power O oh God. Remove now. In your power O oh God. Remove now. In your glory O oh God. Remove now in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Exodus chapter 23, verse 22. The Bible told us, if you listen carefully to me, what I say, and do all that I have said, I will be an enemy to your enemies, and will oppose those that oppose you. Look at it. So, we look at that very text. The Bible says, if we listening, if we listen carefully, to what I'm saying, to what I'm telling you. He said, God said he's going to be the enemy to the enemies of your life. So how this is going to work is to listen. Once we can able to listen to God, then God is going to be an enemy to your enemy right away. And that's what he's saying to you. If you listen to what he's telling us, he said, I'm going to be enemies to your enemies. God says he's going to be enemies to the enemies of your life. I pray to the God will be enemies to the enemies of your life. Can I hear that? Amen. Jehovah God will be enemies to the enemies of your life. Jehovah God will be enemies to the enemies of your life. The enemies of your dream, Jehovah God will be enemies to it. The enemies of your soul, Jehovah God will be enemies to it. 
the enemies of your children, Jehovah God will be enemies to it. In the name of Jesus, He has declared that He's going to be enemies to the enemies of your life. Say, Father, be enemy to enemies of my life. No, let's firstly let's pray. Father, help me to listen because that's the key. I will push you to what He's saying. Say, Daddy, help me to listen to what you are telling me. So that when you listen, now God be enemies to the enemies, the one that oppose you. The one that says, no, you are not going. The one that says, no, your children is not going. Let's pray. Let's ask for the help of God. Say, Father, help me to listen carefully to what you are telling me. Help me, help my children to listen to what you are telling them. Father, help me to listen to what you are telling me. Can you pray that prayer? You know when you are, when you are listening to what God is telling you. Now God is going to rise and be enemy to your enemies. In the Yadavabosu to Yavan. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Lito Yamasim to Yavan. Pray, pray to God. In the Limazu Tondo Yata Kushatelia. Pray and talk to him. Father, be enemies to my enemies right now. In the name of Jesus, open your heart to pray. Pray and talk to Jesus. The Lord to be enemies to your enemies. In the name of Jesus, my Lord and my I want you to be enemies to my enemies. In the name of Jesus, pray and ask the Lord. Father, be enemies to my enemies today. Listen to the Lord. Open your heart to God. The Lord God of heaven to be enemies to your enemies. In the name of Jesus. That you are God to be enemies to your enemies. Open your heart to pray. Pray and talk to God. He said, if you listen carefully, the Lord will be enemies to your enemies. If you listen carefully, Jehovah God is going to be enemies to your enemies. And from today, be enemies to my enemies. In that, be enemies to those that oppose me. Those that stand as hindrance to my way. Those that stand as hindrance to the life of my children. Open your heart to pray. Let God of heaven be enemies to your enemies. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. We pray, Leviticus chapter 26, verse 6. Leviticus chapter 26, verse 6. He said, I will grant peace in the land, and you will lie down, hallelujah, and no one will make you afraid. Look at it. God said, I'm going to grant you peace in that land. That know that you're going to lie down in peace. That no situation of your life, no circumstances of your life will make you to be afraid. Then the Lord says, I will remove the white beast from the land, and the sword will not pass through your country. Listen, listen to what the Lord is telling you that is going to do this in your life. Lift your voice and say, Father, in the name of Jesus, grant me peace. Listen, when someone has a peace, you will not be troubled. I pray for you, you will not be troubled. I pray you will not be troubled. Whatever thing that is troubling your life, heaven will remove it. You will not be troubled. Peace upon your life. Peace upon your children. Peace upon your family. Your life will not be troubled. Heaven will grant you that peace. Heaven will grant your children peace. Heaven will grant your marriage peace. He says he's going to grant you peace over your job. That you will not live from paycheck to paycheck. He said he's going to grant you peace in your marriage. That your marriage shall be in peace. He said he's going to grant you peace for your moving forward. Open your heart to God. Father, grant me peace now in the name of Jesus. Pray and talk to him. Pray and to God. That God God of heaven to grant you peace in the name of Jesus. In Kotoya na 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 masun to yaba, le brendo si ken to yaba, bin to kora bakushe teleba. Open your heart to God, the Lord to grant you peace. He said, I will grant you peace in the land. You will lie down in peace. In to yaba, open your heart and pray. In Jesus' name, 
We pray, tell the Lord, Daddy, he says he's going to remove every wild beast from the land. Every wild, the wild beast is to kill them. Those that after your dreams, the wild beast of your life, the wild beast of your children, those that make themselves to be animal. Hallelujah. You know, I've, I told you I've seen one in my life. You know, people that turn themselves to be something else, whether it's their spirit. You know, I could remember one time I've told you one day that uh, we are coming at the night vision. You know, in, in, you know, you can see in that house. You know, like this this bell is not right, but uh, you know, you, know, you just know that something is not right with this very you know a bird at midnight hour. They kind to the windows of somebody. Not it's, it's not a mistake, you know. You know, it's not a mistake. You know, you know that pastor oh, maybe you are too exaggerating or something like that. You know, no, it's not a mistake. It's just things you see with your own eyes at midnight. You know, because if you know it's a mistake, the bird flew to one side and later on came back and he entered that window of that very house. And it, not a mistake. You can say, oh, you say, oh, but the bird probably lived there. Maybe, maybe you, no. no. Because some people turn themselves to be a white beast in your life. You know, we have seen some movie, no, no, no movie, some, I don't really, sometimes some people can be in confusion. You know, so I know what that I like, I know some people probably in confusion, you know, sometimes in Africa they see this one, he says something, you know, the, the person have a dementia. Hallelujah. He said, but yeah, some people have dementia and they're talking nonsense out of their mouth. Oh, they say they are confessing. That, and it probably be it can be two weeks. The person probably have a dementia. Oh, they saw that woman here, Nickel. No. I also believe all that this person has a dementia. He don't know this what he's doing. Hallelujah. So you know, people begin to mask the person down. But you know, sometimes they see something out of their mouth, which you know that oh, even if somebody has dementia, that should not be what is coming out of their mouth. I know. So I try to balance it. You know, I know the power of darkness in oppression. Also, I know certain things in life that we think is enemy is not enemy. This person is sick up there. Hallelujah. He has a dementia. That's why he's saying nonsense out of it. He is going to take him to the hospital. But certain things that comes out of your mouth, we know who it must be. Their confession. You know, you know that oh, even though he has a dementia, that person should not go that route. I also know that too. Hallelujah. Some people turn themselves to be a white beast in our life. Say that they remove them. That they block it. That one standing in the way, not to see the power of God in our life. They can't hold God, but they are holding you. That's why you need to hit. That's why you need God to come. Listen, enemy cannot hold God, but they can't hold. They can't hold God. Enemy cannot hold God, but they are holding you. Tell the Lord, my Father, remove them in the name of Jesus. I want to open your heart to God. That Lord God of heaven, Mazikatoria Masutoya, Father, remove them. Every white beast in my head, every white beast in my dream, every white beast in life for my children. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Jehovah God, remove them now in the name of Jesus. Lift your voice to him, Mazikatoria Masutoya. Lift your voice to Jesus. Help you, white beast. Father, remove them. Open your heart to God. Lift your voice to Jesus. That Lord Jehovah God to remove every white beast in your family. Every white beast. He says, good to remove the white beast from your land. Those that don't want those things to grow. Those that don't want those things to move forward. Those that don't want your children to be blessed. Those that is blocking away the blessing. Every white beast of my life. Every white beast of my life. Open your heart and pray. That stands as intransition. That stands as obstacle. That stands as failure. As the Lord, every white beast of my life. Every white beast of my dream. Every white beast of my children. Lift your voice to God. 
the Lord God of heaven to remove in your power, O oh God, in your power, Jehovah, 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 remove every white beast, every white beast of my dream, every white beast of my life. Every white piece of my children, every white piece of my marriage, as the Lord Patu Katoyaba, Le Brendo Son Toyaba, Le Brendo Siketelebon, Le Brenda as the Lord to you. Every white piece in your body, in the life of your children, somebody begin to pray that Lord God of heaven to begin to remove the white piece that stand as obstacle in the life that is blocking away the glory. That is blocking the way in the name of Jesus. My son told him, Matasata, Repatoria Matata, Repatoria, my son to Yaba, Repatoria, my sin to the bone. In Jesus' name, we pray. I pray every white beast of your life, eating down the bread too, standing as entrances in our prayers, holding us back in life. Every white beast of your life today. God will remove them. Can I hear that? Amen. Jehovah God will remove every white beast of your life, every white beast of your dream, every white beast in your body, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, my Father. The Canonical chapter 20, verse 1 says, When you go to war against your enemy and see the horses and the chariots and the great and the army greater than yours. Do not be afraid of them. Praise the Lord. Why God is telling you? He said, when you see the big gun, when you see the artillery, you see the all those things that is uh, so powerful. The weapons of enemy. What people are saying. What is happening all around. You know, what you are hearing. It's, the, it's, it's real. It's something that you see. You know, this is not only a spiritual battle now. That now this is a physical battle that they can see. God is telling them when you go to war against the enemies, your enemies, and you see the chariot, you see, when you see it, this is not a spiritual realm. This is a physical realm. There are many things in your life. It has come out of spiritual realm. Now it has turned to affliction in the body. Not only you are suffering spiritually, that thing has come to your body. You can see it. It has been the spiritual aspect may be the root but there's something that you are experiencing in your body, you are experiencing at the place of work, you are experiencing your finances, you are experiencing the land, the Bible told you don't be afraid of what you see, don't be afraid of what they are telling you don't be afraid of that report, don't be afraid of what you are hearing he said don't be afraid of them because the Lord your God who brought you up out of Egypt will be with you. Listen, God is on your side. In that, in that, that God, why is he with you? To fight your battle. Open your mouth and pray. He's with you to fight your battle. Say, so, Daddy, begin to fight my battle. Remove every blockage of my life. Fight my battle. Until God step in. To prayer of Daniel. Things is not moving. Until God step in. Pharaoh don't want them to go until God step in. Sambalat and Tobiah, they don't want the world to be built. Open your heart to God. Step in for me and give me my healing. I don't know where you are here. Step in for me and grant me my purpose. Is that what you are trusting God for? Step in for me and open my womb. Is that what you are believing God? Step in for me. Step in for me and give that joy to me. Can we lift our voice and begin to pray? Can we open our heart to God? Can we lift our voice to Jesus? 
that Lord God of heaven to step in, to break the yoke of heaven, to remove every negative voice over you, to remove every negative power over your children, step in for me to move me forward, to take me higher. Somebody pray that prayer. Let God of heaven step in for you to lift you up in this season, to take you there right now. My Lord and my God, step in for me to break the yoke of enemy. Step in, O God, in Jesus' name. We pray upon these desires of mass that you remove the entrances in the way. Now mention those things. Listen, when you pray, do just pray, open prayer. Mention that many things. I learned that from the life of Bartimaeus, else. The Jesus encounter with Bartimaeus else makes us let God understand. God is very, you know, he knows everything. Even though before you ask, he knows you. But sometimes he wants you to pour your heart to him and you know what, what you are talking about. God wants you to you yourself to know what you are talking about. But are you sure? Jesus knew that Patmo is a blind man and he knew he's calling him to help him. And he still asks him, what do you want me to do for you? It can be what Patmo probably need money. Probably don't want his eyes to be open. Hallelujah. Yes, he probably need money. He probably need cloth. Even though Jesus probably knew what is going on, but he want him to express himself to him. He said, what do you want me to do for you? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And those men, yes, and he said that I may have my sight. The root of the problem, the root of the lacking is the blindness. Every root of your problem today, Everyone will uproot it. Let's say that go to the root of my problem and begin to remove it. You know some people, why you don't get a job? Because you don't have the papers to work. That's why you don't get a job. Because you don't have a papers. So you can't work the work. You, you, don't, you, you can't work on your career because you don't have the right things to get the papers. So one thing starts as ignorance. That's the root. Hello? So people, why you don't have a child? The root of the problem, because you don't, you are not married. You want a child. You know your body can have a child, but there's no husband. So I, the root of the problem is God to remove those, to remove, to remove, you know, that, uh, that, uh, not having a, a partner, you know, the root, that's the root of the problem. Um, the root of the problem, you can't able to buy a car because you don't have money. Because you cannot just go there and begin to you can't rob and speaking in tongue cannot do it, give the car to you. So you need money. Hallelujah. The root where you can't exercise your body the way you want to, because you know there's you know there's sickness in that body. So the root of the problem to for you not to walk, to move to, to be agile, the way you want to be agile is the sickness in the body. So the root of the problem of battling my walls is the blindness for him not to see. I pray today the root of your problem, the root of where Adolia Sikaya, of being where you are, the root of your battle, the root of your struggle, ever will remove it. Can I hear that even louder? Yikababo Sikaya, Lembrondo Sindoliaba. Repatolia, but the root on Makata for you not to move forward. You know, there's somebody standing against you. If the person is removed, like Pharaoh, you were able to go. The children of Israel want to go, but Pharaoh said, No, they are not going. But they're stepping down by themselves. There's going to be a battle. They will be killed because there's no weapon to fight. Minto Yanama, they have enslaved them. They have enslaved their mind. Yes, and slay them physically. I pray this morning that the Lord God of heaven may go to the root of your battle, may go to the root of your struggle, may go to the root of your sin in the name of Jesus and uproot it and uproot it and uproot it and uproot it. The root of where I am, limping those here that all us, that all our life, that all our dream, ever we go there this morning and remove it. Ah, remove it. Ah, remove it. The root of Akaza, Indo Yamara. Somebody pray that prayer. 
Father, go to the root of my life and remove every stagnant shame. Father, go to the root of my life and remove every blockage. Father, go to the root of my life. Open your heart and pray. Father, go to the root of my life. In the name of Jesus, I remove every stumbling block and the power that hold me, that hold my dream, that hold my life. Somebody pray that prayer that Lord God of heaven, the makers of heaven, to go to the root of your life. In the name of Jesus, open your heart and pray to the root of that battle, to the root of that struggle, to the root of that shame. In the name of Jesus, thank you, good God. I pray for everyone that the Lord God of heaven will go to the root of your battle today and remove everything that stands in here until that thing be removed. Whatever thing that stands as hindrances for you not to have what you're supposed to have. Whatever thing that stands as blockage for you not to exercise the freedom that you have in Christ. In the name of Jesus, everyone will remove it now. The Lord will go to the root of the battle, the root of that struggle, the root of that hindrance, the root of that sickness. Some people is the arrow, is the arrows of enemy, is not is is not a physical thing. Even though you go to the main doctors, you go to this one, that, they can't see anything. Even though they apply many medicine. Oh, take this medicine, paracetamol, you know, I don't know, I'm just saying those things to you. You can't do it because that's not the, the root of the problem. It's not a medicine. If the root of the problem, if you take the medicine, you, know, you get the healing quickly. Hallelujah. The root of, is the enemy, the arrows of enemy. The arrows of enemy must be removed. Before the healing. Today I pray for you. To every root of our life. Every root of that battle. Every root of that sickness. Every root of that problem. Today ever we go there. And remove it. Every blockage. Remove now. Every blockage. Remove now. Every blockage. Remove now. In your own. Every blockage. That's why Jesus manifests. To destroy the works of the devil. That's why Jesus showed up to destroy the works of the devil. That Jesus showed up to destroy the works of the devil. Every root of battle, every root of struggle, every root of limitation in our life. In the name of Jesus, let God of heaven remove it and return no more. Let God of heaven remove it and return no more. Let God of heaven remove it and return. No more. God can do it today. You don't have to wait for tomorrow. God can minister that life to you today. You don't have to wait for tomorrow. I speak to every root of battle. I speak to every root of struggle. I speak to every root of shame. I speak to that every root of that delay in your life, in that your marriage to vanish away. You are here to receive peace. You are here to receive to, re, to receive your miracle. That's why you run to God. Why do we pray? We pray to receive. Why do we pray? We pray to believe God. Why do you pray? You pray things to turn around for you. You pray to get it. That's why you are here because you can't do it. Because you are here this morning. Receive your blessing. Because you are here this morning. Let those doors open. Because you are here this morning. In the name of Jesus. Let your miracle happen. I call your miracle out. I call your miracle out to manifest your life. I call your dream out to come to fulfillment. I call your healing out. Receive your healing. I call your deliverance out. Receive your deliverance. To do all what you believe God for. Receive it. No more hindrances. Let it begin to happen. All what you trust God for. Let it begin to happen. All what you believe God for. In the name of Jesus, all what you have faith in it before the Lord begin to happen in transition of the God. Vanish away in transition of the God. Vanish away. Delay, blockage, vanish away. All what you believe God that you are waiting for, that you put your hope in God, that you put your trust in Him, let it manifest. I call it out. Manifest now. Manifest now. No more delay. 
No more holding back. Thank you, good God. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Can I hear that? Amen. Amen. Now, ask God. Ask tell the Lord that very thing. Now, in your own way. Anytime they say you should ask, please don't be your moment. That's your moment to pour your heart to God. God wants to hear you. And by telling him, you are putting him in action. Tell the Lord what you need. In the name of tell the Lord what you need right now. Somebody open your heart and say to God what you need. Tell the Lord to open those doors for you. Tell the Lord to remove the blockage that is standing in the way. Tell the Lord to go to the root of that battle, of that sickness in your body. Tell the Lord to transform your blood and renew that your blood, your blood to receive the blood of Jesus right now. Pray over your marriage, pray over your children, pray over your life, pray over your needs, pray over your breakthrough. Pray over your family. Pray. Father, you will do this for your children. You will make a way for them. You will turn things around. That they, are, they are saying, Father, listen. Let their miracle begin to happen. Thank you, my Father. That they are coming back with a great testimony. Thank you, Father. Because you open those doors for them. Thank you, Father. You will show your supremacy. You will show your sovereignty. Over every request. You will show your mercy and your kindness. Over every request this morning. That you will show your mercy. Over every request. Thank you, my Father. Your people shall come back with a great testimony. And give all the glory back to you. In Jesus' name. Our Lord, we pray. Can I hear that? Amen. 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 Amen in Jesus' name. Now, let you just believe it and you will see it. Act in faith and you will see the miracle of God is going to happen in your life in Jesus' name. I want you to help me to pray. Somebody send a picture of a daughter to me. I want you to help me to pray. That Lord, you are God to heal this very daughter. We pray that sickness She's in the hospital. Let's pray that we ask for healing. Please join me to pray for her. I don't really know her name because there's no name here. I don't know her name. Okay. But she's in the hospital. Okay, there's a name here. Okay, okay, here, yeah, there's a name. Let's pray. Okay, that what you have God to pray that the hand of God should heal her. Please lift up your voice, every mother, every father. Lord, we pray for healing. In the name of Jesus, this daughter, wherever she may be right now, at the hospital, that we send the angels of God to go and perform the healing. That Jehovah God to heal her. In the name of she will live, she will not die. To declare the goodness of God, that our trouble shall come to an end. We pray for her. Somebody pray for her right now. Pray for that this daughter, the precious daughter, before every crown of death, Holy Ghost, throw it off. Every crown of death over our life. Jehovah God, remove it. Every crown of death, Father, remove it. That the crown of life, she will live. Crown of life, she will live. In that she will come out of this situation to glorify you. In the name of Jesus. Lord, you will break that yoke in her life. Lord, you will break that yoke in her life. You will give that peace to her. And your name alone will be glorified. Thank you, righteous God. Thank you, Holy One. Father, we join our faith together. We send you to go right now to perform that healing in this life of your daughter. Lord Almighty, as I lay my hand, God Almighty, let her be healing. Let her be total deliverance, O oh God. And let your name alone be glorified. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name, I pray for you, all your daughters and your son. That no will no more over any daughter, over any son, in the name of Jesus. The Lord will secure you over your life too. Over my life, we will not cry. Jehovah God will redeem our soul. Thank you, blessed Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. And make sure you share it. Someone can still pray it. 
and also can still receive their miracle, send it, hallelujah, send it to somebody, they can still pray it and still receive their miracle. Once your faith is connected, you can still get it. Hallelujah. Let us pray the prayer continue tonight at the same time by 12 Eastern time. Sometimes I, I purposely push it to one sometime. Today I put 12 there because, you know, you know, because many countries sometimes, you know, sometimes I'll try to do that. Um, so you just put that 12, let's pray there, but if you wait a little bit more, I know that you will go bring healing to your life in the name of Jesus. So, so join me by then. And also if you are in the area, and I'm inviting you to come and celebrate with us this, um, this Saturday and Sunday, you know, just for the anniversary of the church. And, uh, and I pray the Lord you will go do great things. And also on my traveling journey, I've been praying about it and see what the Lord is going to do because that's the main purpose, you know. Prayer line is good. I, it's okay. But sometimes when we are still doing it and God is telling you to do something else, you know, you must just obey God. Hallelujah. When you are doing this certain thing and it is telling you to do this, you, know, you just have to obey. I mean, you have to be in the right position. Hallelujah. And I pray the Lord you will go and do great things in your life. So by God's grace, let's see what the plan And those, I've told us, those that we are here in the state, except to, you know, just put things, you know, you can't hold on to this COVID, COVID stuff, you know. Things is going on, party is going on, so why the things of God is not going on? And I pray the Lord you will go bring healing our deliverance, our fulfillment. So let us put, let us put to work to it. And uh, by God's grace, let's see what the rest of this year are for us. Uh, as the, the plan of God and the plan to go out there. And I pray the Lord you will God do great things for us in Jesus' name. Let's share the grace. Father, I cover that water by the blood of Jesus. To everyone that lifts it up by faith, we ask for that aid to this water. To everyone trusting you for the fruit of the womb, O God. You open, you open their womb to anyone that needs healing in their body for a baby. Daddy Lord, you will heal them. You will do this, O oh God, and your name alone will glorify. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's share the grace together. With the grace of Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fresh Holy Spirit. We will trust now and for more. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of life. And shall then ask the Lord forever and ever. Amen. God bless you. Thank you for being here. God bless you. Thank you.